It's Atlanta's number one hip-hop station, Hot 107.9 at home for the Ricky Smiley Morning Show. Of course, you know it's your fault, B-High. Radio Shouty stepping in the building. I got some A-Town players that got a smash hit on deck for you. I'm talking about Day Day Nitty Beats. What's good with it, fellas? What's happening? Hello, what What's happening? I mean, I just got to tell my story first off, man. You know, I saw Mook B over there at New Radio on Instagram bumping the song. Right, right. And I was like... Damn, whatever this man playing in these 15 seconds yeah. in jail. And I was like, when I <laughs> yeah. see that boy move, I'm going to ask him about it. Yeah. But when I seen him, I forgot to ask him about it. Yeah. Then my young partner, DJ JT, yeah. he was like, B, I was at Crucial, man. And uh, nigga named Day Day and Book, they came in there and made a movie in that thing. And I was like, yeah, okay, okay. I said, let me hear the song. Yeah. He played the song, and I said, that's the same song that I heard that boy Mook playing. <laughs> yeah. You understand that? Yeah. Hotel hit me up. Yeah. Hotel was like, hey, B, it's a guy named Day Day, and it's going down. <laughs> I said, okay. I said, send me the record. Let me see what you're talking about, Hotel. <laughs> I listened to the record. It's the same song, same man. Same song. So one, what I must say is that I, you obviously got a movement behind the music. Yeah. Yeah. How does that? And the last time I seen something like that was with that boy Rich Homie. Okay, that was yeah. the last time <laughs> I seen somebody that had that movement to where folks was talking about it before you actually met the person or heard the song. Right. You right. just kept on hearing the name, and you're like, okay, what is this? What what's going on with it? Right. Explain to me how you got it off the ground and got the movement crunk up with it. I got it off the ground off. Oh, first, I. Would, when that, when that, when I first dropped that song, it's a girl named Antoinette. Shout out Antoinette. Mm-hmm. Um, <laughs> she got she what well, she did. She had convinced me to um do an open mic. Yeah, and I was just like, man, I don't want to do no open mic. You know what I'm saying? Uh huh. So she convinced me. She would call me, call me. I would dodge in the car. She called me from another number. Yeah. <laughs> and I answered. Then she was like, "See how you playing? See you need to come on." Yeah. So I told her, "Come on and get me, let go." So boom, I went up there. We were shooting through three songs, mm-hmm. and so. We in the car, outside the club. Mm-hmm. I'm like, we played the three song. I said, okay, cool, let's do that one. She said, yeah, this is a good one. Mm-hmm. So on and on, I go in there, sign up. They call me, get on the stage. Went crazy. Very performing, went stupid. Uh. I told my as soon as I get out of the stage, I had everybody coming over there. What's your name? It felt good, you mm-hmm. feel me? Mm-hmm. So boom. So ever since then, I started going every Wednesday. Yeah. Man, just got crazy and crazy from there, dog. Like I would meet new people. Yeah, our our song was getting noticeable. It was then then DJ Playboy. He just loved it so much. He just started putting it in rotation on the hot night. So That's right. it just went crazy from there. Now, for folks that don't know, I mean, the name of the song is "What You Mean." Right. Where you from with it though, Day Day? I am from Forward Boulevard. See, and that's another thing, too. You know, with certain music, Nitty, you know where I'm about to go with this. I already this. know. I already know. It's a certain sound that you only going to get out of Atlanta. Right. You know, when you hear somebody say, you know, 17 with a 38, don't mess around <laughs> and make me 38. Yeah. yeah. I totally yeah. understand yeah. where this man yeah. is coming from with that. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Nah, yeah. But that's only that lingo that you going to know if yeah. you use it on a regular basis. Yeah. 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 So that was another thing that made me excited when I heard the music. What is the creative process behind this stuff, though, Day Day? Well, first of all, I came up with the first like how how I started going in. Yeah, I just I came out there. I was at work. I used to do concrete and flooring, mm. and, I, and I was on a big ground. Yeah, and when I be on the ground, you just you can't do nothing but think. Yeah, so I just came up my head like right, feel me like a pin, y'all. Then so I was like, whoa! So I cut the ground <laughs> off, pulled my yeah. iPhone out, pulled yeah. my notepad yeah. out, wrote that real quick. And as I was doing the whole flow, I was just putting piece by piece by piece. Mm-hmm. And I called my um, producer, Mercy. Shout out Mercy. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So I called Mercy. I was like, man, Mercy, man, I got like man, I got like eight bars. Man, I need you to make the beat right in front of me. They go crazy. Yeah. Mercy said, pull up tonight. So I pulled up, man. We in a, man. I, I'm in the ear like the hymn. Right? Send me like a pain, y'all. You do balance, <laughs> y'all. Mercy right there on the piano like the hymn. Mm-hmm. Eh, 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 eh. That's right there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm piped up and I'm telling yeah. hey man, look man, dude, put a little right here. I'm gonna put that thump in, in there so when it hit, right. them folk like, ooh. So man, how don't get to doing them things on that man. Shout out Mercer, man. You yeah. know what I'm saying? What you mean? Already. How do you feel being in the game though now? I mean, what has been that transition for you? Because I mean, I know folks is going crazy over the record. Right. And it's starting to turn up. I mean, you in the club and folks is going crazy to your face. Right. You see what right. I'm saying? Right. Folks throwing money and all that crazy. Right, right, right. right. Tell me about that experience. Man, um, 
first of all, you don't even know that I used to sit. Behind, I used to get on the computer. I used to watch. I I be watching all your videos. Oh, get I out of here! I swear to God. <laughs> I swear to God. I swear to God. <laughs> when my mountains, are, shout out my mountains, aunt. I yeah. told him I had said we were talking in the car, and he was like, "Um, you gonna be talking to Beehive?" I like Beehive. I like that man who be like, "Oh, radio shouting." <laughs> and then I'm like, "Yeah." So I'm like, "Okay, cool." I like he energy home, yeah. he turning it on. Yeah. You feel me? So shout out Guap. That's the video I had. Did. Yeah. So shout out Guapo. Yeah. Man, oh, I saw Pee Wee too. You feel what I'm yeah. saying? So I was Doing like, the fam. "Man, you feel me?" So yeah. when I saw that man, I used to do. I used. I used to look at a lot of. I used to get on World Star Hip Hop a lot, man. I used to get, I just used to be looking at it. I used to be yeah. in the bathroom, practice interview. Yeah. It's on everything I love. It's on everything. I used to sit in the bathroom, practice interview, and sit right here, like I'm just talking right here. And then it's just a good feeling just being right here. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. Getting paid for something you love to do. Yeah. Yeah. Bless. I mean, Bless. you definitely earned it, but I mean, you get the hook up with a legend in this thing, though. Man. Thanks. I mean, a guy that understands a hit when he hears one. Shout out Nitty. You see what I'm talking about? <laughs> Shout out I mean, Nitty, man. I mean, himself. Oh. Shout out I mean, Nitty. I mean, Nitty talk to me, man. I mean, nah, how did the real. relationship come about? Man, you know what, man? Be hot, man. First off, man, I got to salute you. You know what I'm saying? What you been doing for the city in this, in this radio station. Salute. Appreciate salute. You know what I'm saying? Salute. Um, no, nah, I mean, my little brother, DJ Anthem, man. I used to call him a DJ, man. I ain't never seen him spin a record, but yeah. man, that's my little brother, though, man. I love him, though, man. Yeah. He brought me the day they record, man. Um, sent it to me, and um, it's been about three, about three, four months ago. Yeah. And um, he sent it to me. I sat on the record probably about a good two weeks, mm-hmm. and uh, when I listened to it, I played it one time and I tried to hate it. <laughs> right. Yeah. So be high. I tried to hate the record. Right. Yeah, that's the only way to make sure I, it's man, real. Man, I had a little slick hate in me. Right. Yeah. So I tried to hate the record, man, and I messed around and when the gas station came back, I said, "Let me throw it on one more time." So I played it again, and I played it again, kept playing it. Mm-hmm. Next thing you know, I called Ant back. I'm like, man, who is this little dude? I need to meet him. So, man, he pulled up on me, man. They, they so hood, man. They pulled up on me on, on um, Metropolitan, man, at the little, <laughs> the little, the little, the little it's like a little entertainment Scary complex. Yeah. The, 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 man, uh, bowling alley. so the boy got in the back seat with me, man. I went down there, man. I had about three pistols. I thought it was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> so I went down there, man, but uh, he got behind me, him and his homeboy. His homeboy got hair. Like this, Shout out DK, man. I'm talking Shout about out so, DK. Them little boys, I said, these some wild little boys, but at the yeah. end of the day, you know what I'm saying, the music, he was back there freestyling in my back seat. And I told Ann, I said, man, I got to sign him. Mm-hmm. So I kind of just kept it under the radar, man, the last three months up until, um, you know, I just did, a, I just closed a deal with him. Um, you know, we did this situation with uh, 300. You know what I'm saying? Shout out shout to out 300. Shout out to 300, man. So, Celine, Celine. You know what I'm saying? Sound? Leo Corn, Kevin Lyles. Everybody, Shout man. Out. So you know, we just did a deal, man. And I kept it under the radar because um, it, it was a little little bit of a bidding war going on. You know right. what I'm saying? So yeah, we was coming off of the um success of the, of the Rich Homie Corn record I did with my little brother DJ Spin. Shout out Corn, man. Shout That's out right. Corn. That went my number dog. one. So I was just looking for that right next artist to co-sign, man. And um, God just sent Day Day, man. And uh, right now I'm putting the whole house behind Day Day. That's right. You know, so right. I think Atlanta needed somebody, man. Shout out to my Jeezys. The tips, you know what I'm saying? Everybody two chains. Yeah, I think it's them, just, just time right now to just bring somebody new that can keep carrying that torch. Exactly. And I it's think Day Day is the one. Man. Definitely. Now, I mean, back to that number one you just dropped, though, too, man. I mean, with that boy Rich Homie, because it got that uh, nitty sound in there. When I heard it, you and Spence got busy on that thing. Yeah. What was it like when you looked up and you said, oh, there's another one? Man, it was a blessing. I just thank God, man, number one. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because... Um, you know, I've been blessed to, to be in the game like 15 years now. Of course. And, um, you know, I just, um, you know, with Rich Homie Corn, I watched him. I'm the type of producer. I don't just go in with a lot of people. Mm-hmm. So you're not going to hear a lot of my records on mixtapes and stuff. Mm-hmm. So I went in um, and studied Rich Homie Corn about three years. And um, Spins had a relationship with him. And um, me and Spins did, went in the studio and did the beat. I told him, I said, man, go and send it to Corn. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Corn sent it back to us. Mysteriously, some type of way the record got leaked. <laughs> Within seven days, we had 1.2 downloads on SoundCloud. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So, um, 1.2 million. You know what I'm saying? So, um, the rest was history, man. We um set a little bit of history. The first record to go independent number one in the last ten years. Yeah. Besides yeah. DJ Unk, walk it out, man. So it was a blessing, man. So. And see, I hate to say it like this, but I got the same feeling when I heard that man record that I felt when I heard that uh, Rich Homie Quan record because when I heard that Quan, yeah. I was like. This is what I'm talking about right yeah, here because Quan yeah. was doing his own thing. Yeah. Yeah. It's always refreshing when you hear somebody do their own thing on the track yeah. and bring to the track what it needs to make right. it come right. across right. from the heart. Because, you know, 
seeing somebody do what somebody else do just ain't entertaining. Yeah, right. it yeah. ain't. Right. Well, I mean to be honest, man. Like you know, I'm a producer, man. You know, I'm, I'm kind of I play both sides of the field. You know, the exec side and the mm-hmm. producer side. So, um, honestly, um, little, shout out to the little producer named Mercy. Mm-hmm. I've been watching Mercy about six years. Yeah. And I always wanted to, you know, sign him and put him up under my wing because out, Mercy. I was like, that little dude with a beast. Uh-huh. You know what I mean? So now it's just, the, it was like the perfect opportunity for me to work with him. You know what I'm saying? And uh, me and Day Day, I just went into the studio with Day Day recently and we got some crazy records that's going to come. Ooh. You know what I'm saying? So y'all go on and get ready. Oh like the What God. You Mean record, that's a good setup record, but. I promise y'all, I'm about to go ape oh these boys God. out here with these records. Day oh, day. my God. One second you had an open mic, the next second you signed a 300 dough, man. man. Real quick. Real Tell quick. me about that experience, man. It feel, it feel good. Man. Yeah. It feel good. You know what I mean? They, they, they told me stay home. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. got to stay home. <laughs> but it feel good, though, you know what I mean? Just make you want to just jump out your skin and just shout, you know what I mean? But I got to keep my composure and keep my poker face on and just yeah. keep working, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Stay positive, stay out of trouble, stay around positive vibe. You feel what I'm saying? And keep the right people around me. So I feel like I'm surrounded by good people and, yeah. and good spirit. And I, and I know for a fact that hotel, um, Nitty B, you know what I mean? Uh, Keys, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, 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 my, my, my team, Love Life, you know what I mean? Shout yeah. out MOE, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? You know, I believe all these people want the good thing for me. Mm-hmm. So um, thank God and God bless them. Be high the whole city messing with this boy, man. I ain't Facts. seen this go on since Jeezy. Mm-hmm. Shout out to the snowman, Facts. but I ain't seen this go on, man. Since like when Jesus started that snowman campaign, yeah. man, and I see the yeah. same love, man. You know, I'm I'm ATL all day, man. Already. So I'm, not I'm gonna proud, argue man. with you on that because see, when JT whipped out that phone and showed me that movie that y'all made over there, at Crucial. Oh my god! I said this is money getting thrown on oh Bankhead, and they just think they're acting <laughs> a damn fool in this game, man. Yeah. And you know that the people are now. That's with no radio play, though. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So that's when you know it's real. You see what I'm saying? Because sometimes the industry can force stuff on you. And then sometimes you can hear stuff that's organically grown from the ground up. Right. How do you feel knowing that you did it the honest way coming up from the ground with it, though? Because a lot of times, you know, forget the dumb stuff. There's a lot of artists out here that just will go up the nitty and say, hey, man, put me on. Right. right they ain't going right. to come to you with no hit, no nothing. Right, They're right. just going to say, put me on. And if you don't put me on, I quit. Right. That happened a lot, man. Exactly. Yeah. I know it do. Yeah. How was it for you saying, you know what, I'm going to just go ahead and work it on out? Well, it, it, it started from the drive. You feel what I'm saying? Just me knowing knowing me coming from the struggle I came from, mm-hmm. coming from 23 on 23 with four children. You feel yeah. what I'm saying? Coming from um, sleeping in the bando, you know what I mean, with all four of my kids. Yeah. Back then I had three, so, you know what I mean, had to go out there breaking houses to get some money. I ain't had no job. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, I always had a dad's support, but he only could do what he could do. You see what I'm saying? So I felt like I was grown. So just having that drive in me, just knowing that this is what I love to do, this is what I want to do, mm-hmm. it just made me just going to, going to, going to the studio and just go hard and do something they not doing. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, let me clear the record too, B. High. Like he, this is entertainment right now. He didn't really break in no houses. So let's clear the record. He <laughs> they ain't broken no houses, man. So y'all, everybody listening right now, that was an entertainment line. That's why I step in that. All right, go ahead. You may continue. They hit it. Go ahead. But... <laughs> I don't know, you know, uh, yeah, but it's just, basically, I was just about to drive, man. It's mm-hmm. just off, like, um, you know, if, 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 if you got it in you and, 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 and you believe in it, mm-hmm. like, I believe in it so long, you know what I'm saying? I've been yeah. rapping since I was 13 and 16 oh, right. when I was 16. Yeah. So, just knowing, just, I was just looking at people, how they grow and how they messed up at, mm-hmm. and, and, and with, with downfalls at, mm-hmm. I try to, um, try to do the process of elimination, try to do what they not doing, you know what I'm saying? What artists inspired you? Um, most definitely, um, Drake, yeah. Jeezy, Rick Ross, mm-hmm. um, the business side of the, um, hip hop, mm-hmm. I mean, like, Jay-Z, you see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, they, they not only artists, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. They, they, they putting on artists also, mm-hmm. and they building companies mm-hmm. and try to, um, get, 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 um, paid, no, also other ways, you see what I'm saying? So, mm-hmm. them inspired, them, them people type, them type of people inspired me. Now what's next for y'all, man? Man, a whole lot, man. Like uh, he working on the mixtape right now. Yeah. We about eighty percent done with that, man. The boy just got some amazing records, man. Like um, you know, like I said, man, I I, I can't. Some of the music he bringing to me, man. Like he going in just making records, man. Yeah. And the records, man. They I hadn't I hadn't seen nobody work and bring this type of records to me 
in like 10 years. Facts. You know what I mean? Facts. So I'm I'm like, man, I had to have a long conversation with my mom about this boy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I said, I know you've been praying for me. I said, but you done did it now. You know what I mean? So, I mean, the boy Day Day, man, you know, um, he, he got um he got a lot of shows coming up, man. Boy Hotel keeping him booked up, man. So he got a lot of stuff, upcoming stuff going Shout on. Hotel, you know what I mean? So right now it's just we got one mission, man. That's number one. You know what I mean? So, um, you know, it's it's it's, it's just uh, that's, that's that's our goal. I mean, know? being that you don't work with a lot of legends in the game, man. I mean, where are you ranking Day Day in there, man? Man, right now top because you know he 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 playmaker. Yeah. You know what I mean? So he he driving the playmaker ship right now, mm-hmm. and I took fifteen years to build playmaker. He ain't just started overnight. You exactly. know what I mean? So I got a platform, a runway. Him, he got he he finna take off. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I already know. You know, I ain't no psychic, but I can tell y'all this. The boy the boy got them hits. You Thanks. know what I'm saying? So Thanks. I'm behind him, man. Need to be Thanks. behind him. I mean, are y'all coming harder than this what you mean, though, man? Man, listen Cause here, see, man. You know that follow-up is a mother now. <laughs> yeah. I swear, man, listen here. Talk to me. When I tell you, dog, that it's just so much flavor. Yeah. What you mean to us ain't nothing compared to what we having in the, in the cut back there. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So, hey, man, just be on the lookout. Um, Mitch Tate will be dropping very, very soon within next month. Type, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Just no, any. I don't even want to call him no Mitch Tate. We call him the album. It's a baby bro. album, man. <laughs> baby album. Already, I you can I mean? definitely dig it. I mean, how can folks get in contact with y'all, man? You can follow me on Instagram at day day underscore love like d a d a underscore l o v e l i l f e. Twitter same way. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and I changed my name to officially Fabrio. Oh, um, I'm gonna grow a ponytail in it. Now I'm playing, man. <laughs> it's Nitty Beats, man. Same thing. N i t t i b e a t z, man. On Instagram, Twitter, Yo. all that stuff, man. Yo. You know what I'm saying? Y'all make sure y'all follow my homie Day Day, though, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all better. That, that's him. That's, he, he on it. Let's go. Already, man. Appreciate y'all coming man, through this thing. You, Thank bro. you. Thank Stay you, man. Y'all number the best in much. Thank you, Beha. Beha Radio, shout it, man. It's Hot 1079. Let's go.